Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Which method of water control affects the most freshwater resources? Water is vital for life, and managing it is a complex affair. When it comes to freshwater, various methods ensure its availability and quality. Dams, levees, and reservoirs are just some tools we use. But which reigns supreme in influencing freshwater resources? Dams are titans of water control, creating reservoirs behind their walls. They serve multiple purposes, like hydroelectric power and flood control. By storing large volumes of water, they impact entire ecosystems. This makes them key players in freshwater management. Levees, on the other hand, are like the guardians by the riverbanks. Built to prevent floods, they keep rivers in check during heavy rains. Although crucial, their direct influence on water volume is less than dams. Reservoirs are the colossal cups that hold our water supplies. They are often formed by dams and are central to water distribution. Their sheer size makes them significant in freshwater management. Groundwater management involves tapping into aquifers. This method supports agriculture and drinking supplies. It's less visible but profoundly affects freshwater availability. Now the drum roll, please. Dams affect the most freshwater resources. They have a massive footprint on water systems, altering flow and ecosystems. Their role in water supply, recreation, and energy can't be overstated. Water control is no drop in the bucket. It shapes our environment and supports our societies. To dive deeper into local water management, check out your county resources. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.